Hi children, welcome to our lively session in our biology class. Children, already we discussed about the structure of the heart and the blood circulation through the heart. Today, we will discuss about the cardiac cycle. What is cardiac cycle? The term cardiac refers to the heart. The sequential events occurs in the heart which are cyclically repeated are known as the cardiac cycle. Before the discussion of the heart, we have to know when the heartbeat starts in the human. At the 21st day of the embryonic development, the human heart beat will start. Children, when the heart beat fails, the person will be die. Children, now we will discuss about the cardiac cycle. One contraction and one relaxation of the atrium and the ventricles is known as cardiac cycle. So contraction, it is known as systole. So once observe my hands, this is the contraction. This is known as systole and this is the relaxation. This is known as diastole. To better understand about this cardiac cycle, children, in first stage, we have to imagine that the four chambers in the heart are in relaxed phase. So children, once observe my fist and think that my upper fist resembles like the atrium and the down fist resembles like ventricles. Okay, children. So already I told that in first stage, the four chambers are in the heart are in relaxed state. So they are in relaxed state. So, in second stage, the deoxygenated blood from all body parts enters into the atria through superior vena cava and the inferior vena cava. And also, the oxygenated blood from the lungs enters into the left atria through pulmonary vein. So, the atria fills with blood. Okay. So, in third stage, the atria starts contracting and forces the blood into the ventricles. Okay, children. So, the ventricles gets the blood respectively from the auricles. Okay. So, in third stage, the ventricles fill with the blood. In fourth stage, the ventricle starts contracting. At the same time, the atria starts relaxing. Understood, children? Again, I am saying that the ventricles start contracting. And the atria starts relaxing. So, at this time, the aperture in between the auricles and the ventricles is closed by the tricuspid valve and the bicuspid valve. Why? Because it prevents, it wants to prevent the backflow of the blood into the atria due to the low blood pressure. So, the blood from the ventricles is enters into the pulmonary artery and the aorta respectively. Okay. So, in fifth stage, the ventricle starts relaxing. Okay, yet this time, the aperture in between the ventricles and the arteries gets closed by the pulmonary valve and the systemic valve and produces dub sound to prevent the backflow of the blood into the ventricles because due to the low blood pressure. Okay, children. Like in this way, the cardiac cycle will be repeats. So, this is known as cardiac cycle. To complete one cardiac cycle, it takes the 0.8 seconds time. To complete one contraction of the atria, it takes the 0.11 to 0.14 seconds time. And for the ventricles contraction, it takes the 0.27 to 0.35 seconds time. Children, this like the heart gets the blood and pumps the blood cyclically. It is known as the cardiac cycle. So, like in this way, the blood pumps into the blood vessels with regular intervals. So, it is the heartbeat and the pulse, we know that the pulse, the pulse resembles that heartbeat. Okay, the blood passes in the blood vessels in spritz. Okay, children. Children, I think that you understand about this cardiac cycle. So, children, we will meet with another content. Up to there. Take care. Bye, children.